Hello everyone. My name is Sang Sun Lee. I'm a presenter of this paper. I worked at Naval Labs in Korea. I'm going to talk about today the paper Local to Global Efficient Visualization for a Monocle Camera. Okay, let's begin. Nowadays, the interest of visual localization has been increased because it's utilized for various emerging technologies such as autonomous driving car, robot, or augmented reality. Recent algorithms proposed for the visual localization utilize the deep learning schemes because it must be robust under challenging conditions such as illumination changes or appearance changes. But those methods are hard to be achieved in real-time performance and they have a lot of computational burdens. In this aspect, we present an efficient and robust visual localization pipeline that combines the visual automatic pipeline. For the convenience, I will use the words VL and VO to abbreviate the visual localization and visual automatic pipeline respectively. The key idea is as follows. If a global position is estimated from a VL pipeline, the following motion are tracked by the VO pipeline. Then, if a new global position is estimated again, it optimizes the previous, previous motion and tracks the next motion using the VO pipeline more precisely. And the following steps are the same with the previous steps. In this scenario, there are three main advantages for combining the VO pipeline. First, the VO pipeline has the proposed system run in real time. Second, it resists the avoid of the VL pipeline by reducing the number of records. Third, it can prevent the digital situation, making the trajectory more smooth. Of course, there are many approaches to combine the VL and VL pipelines, but those methods need additional sensors such as IMU, GPS, or Wi Fi. In contrast, the proposed system only utilizes a monocular camera and we solved various problems raised when combining the VL and monocular VL pipelines. The main problems were as follows. First, the VL and VL pipelines have a different coordinate systems on the same degree of freedom. This is because the VL pipeline is operated on the global map, but the monocular VL pipeline is operated on a um, local map with a different scale. Second, they utilize different kinds of local features, learning-based local features for the VL pipeline and handcrafted local feature for the VO pipeline. However, these heterogeneous features must be associated for this system. Third, the VL pipeline sometimes detects first positive passes. We reserved these issues respectively. First, we impose the map alignment module with the proposed scale factor estimator to transform the local map to the global map. Second, we propose a new structure called super keyframe to associate the heterogeneous features. Furthermore, we propose the new learning features guided by the handcraft features to improve the performance of the data association. Third, we propose the place recursion method using the secure information to prevent detecting the first positive places. We tested the proposed system on the two popular datasets, the Sebastian dataset and the Oxford Robocar dataset. The Sebastian dataset is captured for the small scale indoor scenes to compare the centimeter level accuracy. And the Oxford Robocar dataset is captured for the large scale of the scenes to compare the robustness on the challenging conditions. In the results from the Samson dataset, the proposed system showed comparable accuracy to the SOTA method and real-time performance. On the Robocar dataset, the proposed system outperforms the SOTA method in the very clear results. Please watch our supplemental video to see the results. Thank you for listening and for watching this presentation. I hope you guys have a lot of insights from this paper. Please read our paper for more details. If you have any questions, please leave in here and send to our emails. Thank you.